everybody, what's up? I am Trend Cat Pet or Baby Star Dream or Little Star Dream or whatever my um, age play, little play name is. Uh, welcome to my channel if you've never been here or welcome back to my channel if you've already been here. I don't know if I've already said that. If I have, hello again. I wanted to do a review on um, Revolution London, Revolution Makeup London's e.l.f. palette. I totally am a little late on this one because I've just been so busy using it. This is the cutest e.l.f. Um, none of these have a name, sadly. They just have a number. It is pressed powder. And it came in this, it's fuzzy, it came in this cute little thing. They also had like a makeup syrup bottle that was something else and like a couple other palettes. Um, I only grabbed this one. So, this one has a cream, a glitter pink, a normal pink, a glitter gold, a regular light pink, a brown, another brown, this one's more of like a reddish brown. A glitter brown and an orange. Now the glitters I do not recommend using. They don't come off very well or come out very well. Um, you kind of have to like, like you can maybe see that. No. Okay. They don't come off and spread on your eyes very well. Um, you have to use quite a bit of it to to work but the powders are perfectly fine the glitters are just kind of meh um, I would mostly use this glitter as a kind of like a cover and then these one this one you could probably use as a whole regular thingy as a whole eyeshadow and this one you could probably too but make sure that you've got like an eye primer on I mean make sure you have an eye primer on for all of them because I feel like they can wipe off easily but those ones were like, that was my only gripe, is like I had to use so much if I didn't use an eye primer to even get the glitters to show on my eyes. So make sure you use an eye primer with those, for sure. Um, other than that, the makeup palette is, it, it's good. I like the colors. I've been using the cream a lot, I actually have it on right now. My lighting is kind of bad, sorry, but. I have the cream color on right now. It's the one I use the most out of this because I haven't been wearing a lot of pink lately. <laughs> but, um, and brown just usually looks good on me because I got brown eyes. They usually tell you to wear brown with brown eyes, but yeah. So the cream color is really good. And all the, like I said, all the ones that aren't glitter are really, really good. They go on easily. They look good even without a, um, primer. But like I said, I would suggest using a primer if you don't want them to wave off easily and stay on and like, with the glitter, and like I said, with the brown glitter down here, I just kind of use that as a topper. I wouldn't really use it as a, I wouldn't really use it as a base. So maybe use most of the glitters as a topper. I don't know, it's up to you. If you have this, cool, let me know what you think. If you don't have this and you want it, um, I don't know where you can get it now, because like I said, sorry, I'm a little late on this review. This came out over Christmas last year. Um, but if you can find it, make sure you use a primer, and that's kind of all I really have to say about that. So, I hope you enjoyed this review, and I hope you like and subscribe, and hopefully I'll see you again in another video. Bye!